Hello everybody, my name is Oxfu, and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil 2. And just give me one second, give me a chance to get my bearings a little. Okay, we've got the valve handle, I remember what we're going, doing, we gotta run past all them, all them spiders. Use the valve handle to stop the water flow, and go see if we can save Ada Wong or something like that. Sounds like a good plan. Alright. Now if I remember correctly... Yeah, that leads somewhere, but I don't I don't know if we checked that out or not. But if I remember correctly, it's out this way we, we want to go to go back to... Well, the area where the spiders were. Ooh, you're not looking too good, Leon. Oh wait, no, that's just the blood from getting, uh shot in the shoulder or whatever it was. Come on, go around. Go around the dead bodies littering the floor. Don't worry about them. Huh. <laughs> Alright. Should be just a... Oh! Did we go too far? Uh, I think I did. Whoops. That was not what I meant to do then. Hmm. Okay, well, okay, now I'm a bit confused because I thought it was just outside this door that we wanted to go, but I guess I'm wrong. I guess I'm dead wrong. I guess we do have to go back down. Uh, like I said, it's been a few, uh, little while, so... Was this, uh, did we figure out if this was a thing we could move? No? Okay. Again, just catching my bearings right quick. Oh, get on there. Sorry, checking the time also to figure out how long I can record. Gotta get back into the swing of things, get back into the, into the feel of how to do these silly things called Let's Plays. Was it up this way? I think maybe. I don't even know, did we explore the rest of that passageway? Perhaps not, because I think I was just concerned with getting to Ada Wong as quickly as possible. Ha! <laughs> Spiders. Ha! <laughs> you think you can do something to me? Silly spiders. Leons are for zombies, I guess. <laughs> it's not the most clever joke I could have made, but whatever. Alright, and we should just be able to come right over here. Oh no, not the wolf metal. Whoops. Was it over here? I know we needed the valve for something. Just trying to remember what. Shoot, maybe I should have gone back and checked that last video. <laughs> nah, it is right up here, wasn't it? Yep, there we go. No, no, no. We're not going across quite yet. There we go. Oil pressure data transmitter. Insert the valve handle. There we go. Hopefully this is the right valve handle. Hoping there's not, like... In Resident Evil 1, the hex crank and the square cranks and all that crazy stuff like that. <laughs> Alright. Can we take the valve back? Yes, we did. Okay, good. Alright. Let's just mosey on along. Ooh, what is that on the ground? Just something to, uh... Oh, <laughs> it was just, uh... Decoration. Also, more ink ribbons. More saving. Yay! Because we didn't just do that. Oh, yeah. I think I might have talked about it last episode, but it's just ridiculous finding out that this game is... Well, it's easier than Resident Evil 1 because it's made to be easier than Resident Evil 1 that... When Resident Evil 1 came over to the States, uh, they made it pretty much ten times harder. It's just, uh, sorry, I heard a weird clicking noise. Pretty much halved the amount of, um, save points that you could actually, or save items, the ink ribbons that you could actually get. Alright. 
Anybody? Well, whoever's in here, they're gonna know I'm coming, because this is anything but a stealthy approach. Hmm. Was this a door? No, just... okay. <laughs> it looked a little bit like a door. What, I don't know. Can I use this? No. Hello? Ah, that is an alcove. Of sorts. Or is it just the way to turn? Oh yeah, it's just the passageway. Nothing... I don't like this, but we've already seen the spiders, so... I'm not too afraid of the spiders right now, because they're kind of ineffectual when they're not... Oh! Thank God it's you, Ada. Uh, not so much for that thing. Run, Chris, please. Run. Just run. I don't... You're not fighting that. There is no way I'm fighting that. Oh. No. No, 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 no. I don't want to fight this. This is such a bad idea. Well. Well, there we go. <laughs> I mean, what did I really expect? Of course I was going to die as soon as I turned around to fight that thing. Jeez. <sighs> I didn't know what to expect. I don't know if that... I'm, I'm guessing that glowing panel does something now? Because I don't have any cha I don't have any time to really turn around and fight that guy. Whew. <sighs> So I guess I'm going to try to hit that on the way back this time. But now, I know to get a shotgun out. Oh, no. Uh, let's drop off those ink ribbons, actually. So we're going to get enough. And we're going to get some more soon enough anyway. Alright, we'll make our way back. It's not too far, so I'm not going to cut. After all, there's pretty much no danger in the way anyway. It's just... What do we got? A couple spiders. That's it. <laughs> it's like a walk in the park. Oh man, it is good to be recording this again, though. I know I say that a lot of times, but that's because I take a lot of hiatus hiatus I. <laughs> A lot of hiatuses, it seems, these days. Just because, well, I have a lot going on. School, finals, graduate applications, relaxing, vacations. I mean, I, I, I had an important job this, this break. I had to relax. I had to master the art of relaxing, you know, sleeping eight hours a day, or 18 hours a day, using the other four hours just to, f to eat about five gallons of soda a day and four other pizzas. I had the I had my work cut out for me. Yes, combine it, please. <laughs> no, but seriously, I have been relaxing, and that is why a lot of it has... A lot of the, this series has been... Uh, slowed down a little during the winter months just because well i've had a very stressful uh semester so i did need a chance to just not think about anything <laughs> not do anything really except just relax take my time play some video games That's it. <laughs> Got nothing else but that. I'm tempted to save here, but I mean... It seems like a waste. It seems like such a waste, but you know what? Let's do it. Let's let's be wasteful. I'm talking about how I want to relax. I want to relax a little bit more. I don't want to... 
I don't I don't care. <laughs> I mean, I've got eight on hand anyway, so I'm not really that concerned. Yes, I'll mix the herbs. And we'll go see if we can face that alligator a bit. I'm gonna die. But we found Ada. She's alright. She's not, uh... In any trouble, it seems. Well, I mean, she's got a giant alligator that she's fighting, but other than that... It's a high-pressure ga gas cylinder. In case of emergency, the red light will turn on and the gas cylinder w may be removed. Okay. Okay. So maybe that is what we have to do. See, no flavor text uh, showed up earlier, so... I didn't know. It was funny, too. Someone mentioned to me that the uh, reason the first uh, Resident Evil came off as so cheesy, I'm actually going to use this because I've got nothing to lose, uh, is because it, the characters were actually voiced... Oh! Oh! Are we going to Jaws this stuff? I can't... Yeah! Oh man, we did Jaws that stuff. Oh, that was great. But, um, you know, someone was telling me that the characters from the first Resident Evil were voiced by porn stars or something like that. And that's why the voice acting was so cheesy. I have no idea about this one. It seems like a shame that this one doesn't have the same cheesy voice acting, but I mean, I've said that plenty of times. All right. Safety lock device for use in case of an emergency. Yes, I'll release the electronic lock. I mean, come on, we've got... We've saved Ada. Or we've saved herself, actually. Ada was fine, it wasn't even coming after her. But man, those New York Gators. Those things kind of get huge. Oh god, is this going to turn into Star Wars? Walls start closing in and there's... Well, we already beat the trash monster, but... Leon. This bullet wound isn't making things any easier. Why, I bet not. Huh? Oh, thanks, Ada. That's two I owe you. Don't well, seeing that you're the reason we got shot. <laughs> I just found out. John's dead. What? Never mind. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. You can't just leave. Come on. We're, pol we're a police officer. We gotta investigate. Find out what's really going on here. Alright. Just again, checking the time. Making sure we're not going too long or something. Uh, where are we going? I'm guessing just... Oh! Well, isn't that great? Guess we gotta go back and uh, raise the bridge. Of course, I could have done that all re <laughs> earlier, but I figured we'd be going back that way. <laughs> Stay here, Ada. You're not wearing pants. <laughs> oh, that's gotta be terrible. Yep, yeah, there we go. Damn these controls. Just make our way back. Use that valve right quick. Go upstairs, cause Well, I don't I guess we don't really have to go upstairs, but I kinda want to. I don't think we thoroughly explored that upper area because there was a cutscene, so... <laughs> Figure why not. Hopefully I'm... No, I was not facing the right way. Darn it. There we go. Aha!
Now we can proceed. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Alright. So, what have we done today? Well, we destroyed a giant sewer crocodile with all the with all the poise and elegance of a Jaws movie. I think that's that's quite an accomplishment. <laughs> so, I will see you guys next time. Wait, was he just looking at Ada or was there something actually on the ground? Or is he just looking kind of weirdly around? I cannot tell. Ah! Ink ribbons. Like, we need more of those. <laughs> I'm guessing there's probably other stuff you can find in the water then. I'm guessing it's also just on the bottom in places or stuff. Anyway, see you guys next time. Unless blindly play Resident Evil 2 with Mio X Fu. As we continue through the rest of the waste disposal plant. And, I don't know, maybe we'll actually get to the rest of the city or something? I'm not sure where we're going from here. But in any case, see you guys next time. Take it easy.